Good morning. We are so happy that you're here. We vlog every single day. So if you enjoy this video, come on back tomorrow. We're having a cozy work day in our room because the TV is still in there. Um, it's super dark and it feels like nighttime. So I just came out to the living room to grab the to-do list because in between working, I'm going to do some, I don't know, like not like hardcore cleaning, but we're basically just going to like hit some of the to-dos that we need to get done before the baby gets here. Um, and so first thing on that list is vacuum the nursery. but I am making banana nut muffins from those very ripe bananas you saw in yesterday's vlog. Good afternoon, my name is Peter Brookhart. My middle name is Brian, so my full name is Peter Brian James Brookhart. If you had my confirmation name in there, Catholicism. Um, I did nothing on my to-do list that I was supposed to do like on my lunch. Uh, I had a busy morning and then my boss, my director, um, called me and was like, hey, we have to drop literally everything to do this thing by four o'clock. Well, now it's five o'clock and we're still getting it kind of squared away. So. Clearly I didn't do anything on my to-do list for my lunch break because I didn't have a lunch break. So those will get moved to tomorrow, I suppose. Um, we're about to leave here in a minute to go to Disney Springs. Checked my mailbox today. Still no London Marathon medal. That's supposed to be arriving any day now. Can't wait for it for some reason because I'm a sucker for medals. That's really the only reason why you do the Dopey Challenge, especially the only reason why you do it more than once, unless you're stubborn like me, in which you want to do every single one ever, but not doing it this year because it's virtual. Still don't know how I feel about virtuals, but the London virtual was a great long clip. Me talking fast, me talking a lot. It's over now. Oh, I the balloon is up. The balloon is up and it's a gorgeous day. It's so nice. And we may be getting pizza panted, we may be getting deluxe burger, we just don't know. Something. But she's something. hungry. I'm hungry. Tomorrow's Friday. Gotta go grocery shopping. Gotta go grocery shopping. And we're meeting up with Chelsea and Cole. Yeah. We've talked a lot lately about going to pizza Ponte, but now that we've been more serious about not eating vegan food all the time, we're jumping on that. With all the Italian families. Those are all Sarah's peoples. Our people. Yes. All right, we're each gonna get our own slice of pizza and then we're also gonna split the Mortaza sandwich. Mm. I like want the big Roman, like the big slice. Get the but big then, Roman. Then I also want water. We got our food. You can't? Sandwich, pizza for me, pizza for Sarah. Look at this sandwich, it's so good. What do you think? I love that you're still wearing your plant-based cat. <laughs> that was divinity. So good. That square pizza was the best thing there, I think. Sandwich was second. Roma was just classic, but that pizza, the peppers, the peppers on that square pizza were So we've been hanging out, but I wanted to show them. We haven't What's seen them since the engagement. They've been engaged since like five years now. Yeah, eight months Practically. today. Eight, eight months today. Today, the yep. 15th. So say congratulations, Cole and Chelsea. Thank but you, thank you. We've just been we sitting around chit-chatting, catching up, because we haven't seen them since pre the world happened, you know? <laughs> but I want to give them some love. So we're in Sunglass Hut on the west side. These Ray-Bans just came out. They have all different kinds of Mickey's on them. 
really, really cute. And then here are some of the other fun Mickey Mouse designs. And they actually, they don't offer any sort of discount here for the Disney, um, the Disney sunglasses. But the other sunglasses they do. Oh, they have kid sizes too, that's really fun. We're home! He was so excited to see us. Bye, viewers! Yeah, I love you. We got a bunch of mail. And sure gifts. Is. Did we show what uh, Chelsea and Cole got us? No, also our friend Karen got us this. Thank but I guess you. it's high tech. You can record yourself saying things and have your baby listen to it. Yeah. Let's do uh, the locals, the Lakeland okay. locals. So this was from Chelsea and Cole. <laughs> Cute I love that they get us logo stuff like my if you whenever you see me wear my Kent baseball hat that's from Chelsea. Yeah. And Chelsea and Cole got us. And this. Chelsea's parents actually just got us a Cleveland Indians onesie. They're from Cleveland. And, and then the this Queen is... of England gave Lakeland gifted <laughs> Lakeland swans. Yeah. So it's like so known this is a for really nice swans. blanket. It's really nice. I didn't realize how big it was. I didn't realize how repetitive the swan. I thought it was just like one row. Yeah. Oh my that's gosh. That's awesome. So, so nice. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It was so nice seeing them tonight. Our friends Caroline, Sean, and the utter royal King Dave sent us a wonderful package full of a bunch of like... An insane, an insane amount, amount of like pajamas and adorable onesies for James. Just so we're like not going to go coziest, through... the coziest, nicest quality <sighs> British so things. And like they're such good quality. Like they're so they're nice. They're so nice. I felt them. I was like, this feels like it's from the UK, <laughs> you know. And some of them had a cute little collar. I don't want to go through all of them, but you know, your friends get you when they send you the perfect chocolates. And they sent us these oh. vegan truffles. And what's Eve up to? She's up to no good. And I have a weird favorite kind of chocolate, and it's orange flavored chocolate, like how you can get like the chocolate balls that are like look like oranges that you smack in their slices and they actually sent us like orange flavored or, man or mandarin flavored chocolate so thank you guys so much and for all the beautiful onesies and a pennington bear like rag so thank you so much rag uh it's what's like a lovely blanket it's a it's a little blanket it's a little towel what is that what would you call that a blankie a little blankie sorry but you guys know I'm not the best with words. <laughs> we got this little package from Cheryl. Look at those cute little bunny rabbit ears. <laughs> so cute. And these books. Hey, there's a hidden Mickey on that dog. Caitlin and John got us this blanket. So nice and cozy. So nice and personalized. We might bring this to the hospital for a little picture to announce when he arrives, or at least have it to be nice and cozy. Which is so soon. So soon. Wait, 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 we're gonna finish the Bly Manor. We only have one episode left, but I had to show you these these two other pieces when we were putting away the boxes from everybody, <laughs> um, from our friends in the UK. Look at this adorable postcard. It's Dobby, the house elf, or the, the free elf. It's actually a postcard on the back. It says, to James, I am Dobby. I hope you like your socks. And they said Christmas socks. And they also, and friends, thank you so much for the sweet chocolates and the adorable, awesome, awesome pajamas, the plethora of them. But this probably is our favorite thing that came in the box because I don't think you knew that we've been planning and trying to find this hat. Not like we didn't know what kind of hat. We knew we wanted it to be this style. But I literally think this is the hat I've been envisioning. <laughs> that we've just and like. It's from the UK. And it's from the UK. So it's like. His head will fit in it. His head will fit in it. His head is huge, just like his dad's. But. His head will fit in this. I'm gonna try. Thank you. It is perfect. I love the coloring. I love the I love it. The, the like pattern. the pattern. I love how it fits, how it's gonna fit. Oh, three to six months. Thank you, thank you, everybody. Thank you for all the love and messages. We began some amazing messages of support, whether Can I uh, see just that hat so I could text a picture of it to my mom. Yeah. 
Thank you for the messages about just the, all the love and support. Thank you for the messages about it's okay if we do natural birth. It's okay if it's C-section. It's okay if, if anything. We just really appreciate you guys and you guys have been here with us along all this journey. So it's getting very, very close and very, very real. And I'm very, very excited to meet my son. Right? Right. Are you excited? Who's more excited? I'm just kidding. We're both equally excited. But now we're about to eat those chocolates and watch the last episode of this spooky show. Actually, not that it's not that really of a scary show. It's more like a suspense thriller. S- sad. Sad. Really sad. But I'm just keeping the camera rolling. So let Sarah can edit this tomorrow. Still going. You're gonna keep all this in? I hope she does. All right, today is October 15th. It is our nephew Jackson's seventh birthday. Please put down below, have the happiest birthday, Jackson. It'll make his day. We'll make sure that he, the messages get to him. Today's message is by Shri Chim, Chinmo? Chinmo? Shri Chinmo. Always keep inside your heart a pocket full of sweet dreams, like sweet potatoes. I ad-libbed that last part. Happy birthday, Jackson. You're the bomb. Um, House on Bly Manor? The Haunting of Bly Manor? What? Really good. Yeah, what a... I'm sorry. What a twist. Okay. What a sweet last episode. Yeah, we always say, like, we like things that, like, go not how we expected it to. Yeah. I'd watch that again. Like yeah. I'm not, I'm not driven to watch Haunting of Hill House again. Mm-hmm. But I've, I'm driven to watch that series. That the yeah. whole. That's definitely one where like. Now that we know everything. Yeah, that like we would probably notice a lot more. Yeah. It was really good. It's really good. Yeah. Should we sign off? Yeah. Yeah. So today is, um, infant and pregnancy awareness. Like the day, like the whole month is supposed to be. But um, like today, you're supposed to light candles. Yeah, and we don't have any matches. We our, our lighter just right now. Our lighter out. just for now, and we were Peter really tried to light our little candle by Sweet Peas <laughs> Ultrasound, but it just didn't work out. So we're lighting. Um, what would it be? <laughs> lighting like a. I don't know what's the word I'm looking for lighting a candle in our hearts yeah <laughs> for sweet pea and our hearts are with everybody who lights a candle for their their, babies. their lost babies it's good to be home it's good to be home We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.